When should I do it? Do I care? Um, yes, you should care, Kevin. It's <laughs> in the fall is really the best time, especially if you have to amend the pH of the soil. Yeah, so she says in the fall is the best time. In the fall could be the best time. It very well could be for your location. Um, much of the literature I've shown has indicated that the spring might be the best time. So what is, what is my definition of the best time? My definition of the best time would be any time of the year that the nutrient level is likely to be at its lowest, such that you would be more likely to identify a deficiency at that point. You wouldn't want to be taking a sample, obviously, after you fertilize. We would all agree, I think, that the nutrient levels are going to be elevated at that point. And if you did have a deficiency, it's not going to show up on a test at that point. So you'd want to do it when the nutrient levels are likely to be at their lowest. And in the fall, it may be. But much of the literature I've shown, at least two or three papers, have indicated that the spring is oftentimes the time where the nutrients are at their lowest. Of course, there's papers that might show something different. But use, use the general BMP of what's the longest period of time between when you fertilize and when the next time you're going to fertilize. And if that coincides with saying over the winter, then you're going to refertilize, say, in March or April, then, then you'd want a soil sample before that um, fertilization event. Just use some rational critical thinking skills to figure out whatever time that is. But don't just do it in the fall because somebody on YouTube says it or some consultant says it. Okay, don't, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't follow that. There needs to be some sort of you know, evidence to support what time you would do it. And it's probably going to be different based upon where you're living and what grass you're growing.